Hello, my name is Ian McNaughton, uh, Big E. We're doing Big Eats outside today. I feel like I look like a mess, but I can't really tell between the sun and the, and the shade and the camera uh, and, the, and the transition. So uh, not a great look all around. Uh, you guys asked what kind of tea I should review because I'm doing a tea review today. Uh, I got two, technically two different kinds of teas and one's an alcohol. So I got one uh, matcha uh, pack here uh, and then Phil made... Um, no new camera angles. I don't know if you can see, but this kind of green looking tea here doesn't look that good, but made matcha tea. Uh, the other one, Scott asked me to do uh, some Peruvian tea. Couldn't find anything specifically made in uh, Peru. Uh, so instead, I just got some yerba mate and um, just going to South American way this time. Uh, it's a product of the USA. I think it's distributed in California. Yeah. Uh, but in South America, so it's kind of Peru, I guess, in a way. Anyways, and then the uh, last one is a uh, is a twisted tea. Uh, bought a twelve pack of that for uh, March Madness finale tonight. Uh, so I'm gonna start with the matcha tea. I put a little bit of almond milk in here to try and sweeten it a little bit. Uh, so this is pure Japanese matcha stone ground tea. Um, design and packaging Canada, Vancouver. Um, I think I did this right. I put the matcha in hot water and then I whisk it around. Uh, I have no idea how this goes, but here we go. Uh, pure Japanese Domo Matcha Tea from Big E. Hmm. It's actually not bad. It's, it's kind of a neutral flavor. Um, doesn't I mean doesn't really have much of a, a flavor from from my, from my perspective. Maybe I did it wrong. Um, it doesn't taste bad. I, I'll say it's three stars. The matcha's three stars. I, I I don't have anything against it. It's not an awful tea. It's not a shitty tea. It just doesn't have a lot of flavor. Um, just pretty plain. So three stars for the Domo Pure Japanese Matcha Tea. Uh, so now we'll do the organic yerba mate. Uh, we've got a tea bag in here uh, with, with the yerba mate tea in here. Uh, no extra stuff in here, no honey or milk or anything like that. This is just the pure tea. Ooh. It tastes good. It, it tastes better than, I mean, if you've had the cans of yerba mate, it's not bad either. It's just very sugary. So this is, it is, feels more natural, feels more natural, feels better for you than the, the sugary can. Mm. I think I prefer the yerba mate uh, to the matcha. That's just me personally. That's just my opinion. Um, I mean, I don't know if either one, like either, the, either one of them are worse for you or better. Um, yeah, I think it's relatively the same. I think you're doing good if you're drinking both. Um, can't argue with either of those. Uh, but I, I'm probably going to give the Yerba Mate three and a half stars, I think. It's that much better than, than a matcha. Not that much better, but it is that much better. Half a star. I'll probably be drinking that more often now. And then finally, the twisted tea, the iced tea taste. This is an original hard iced tea. Getting drinking started early on Easter Monday, two o'clock in the afternoon. Here we go. Uh, living, this is pretty much being like a college student, just drinking shitty twisted teas. But here we go. Uh, Big Eats twisted tea. That tastes good. I don't mind that. It's a flavored alcohol beverage for select teas and natural and artificial flavors. That's also not bad. I'll probably have a few of those tonight during uh, the Gonzaga Baylor game. If I had to give that a review, um, I think that's three and a half stars. It tastes like ice, ice tea. It doesn't really taste like alcohol, um, which is nice. Makes that go down easier, I guess. I mean, I, I'm going to stay three and a half stars. I think it's relatively the same to the Yerba Mate. I, I don't know if I actually prefer the Yerba Mate or the Twisted Tea. They're both really good. 
Uh, but they're both better, I think, than a matcha. So there you go. Uh, big Eats. Uh, so you get the, the, the matcha is, uh, before I spill my twisted tea, uh, the matcha here, uh, three three stars on a matcha. Yerba Mate. This one, four, uh, three and a half stars, excuse me. And then the actual twisted tea itself, three and a half stars. That's Big Eats uh, for Easter Monday. Hope you enjoyed it. Let us know what else you think we should review. We got a Big Eats uh, segment coming next week that I'm going to announce. It's going to happen over the spring, so be on the lookout for that. But if you got any other suggestions or any other ideas that we should review, let us know. It's been Big E. It's been Ian McNaughton here outside doing the Big Eats. Peace out.